your bag in Strasbourg from the sun and it's officially my birthday and then it's really about to go to the museum on fine art and hello Lola and we're waiting for my sister to come uh, she's putting her stuff in the locker so we're going to be here for about three hours or two and then we've got some dinner reservations this is a big museum um, of the in um, the old Ruby Palace before so excited to see Just in the Museum of Fine Arts with my sister. Oh, I was right behind her. So, we do what's important. I'm gonna actually enjoy myself now. Florentine? From Florence? Yeah? Okay. Italian artists in this this whole region anyway All the Italian artists in this room, all in the 14th century. And this is the cathedral at night. Um, and it's a final night. Rumbi, are you sad? It's a final night in Strasbourg. Au revoir, Strasbourg. Thank you. You've been beautiful. We move on to Colma. But anyway, now we're heading off to some dinner plans for my birthday. And um, yeah, so and then we go around the city a little bit more. And then we go. Okay, we'll leave in two seconds. Gosh, I got dinner reservations at 6.30. And it's such a pretty popular place. So we can't afford to be late. And we've got seven minutes to get there. But I just want to see this for the last time. Oh, look at that bridge. It's all lit up. Rumbi? Rumbi, are you behind me? Oh, Strasbourg. I think I find it's better than Frankfurt. So much more to do here in Strasbourg. So we've made it here to Camusel House. This is one of the most beautiful buildings here in Strasbourg. One of the oldest as well. We managed to get a booking. People think are coming in. That's why it looks empty. 
Oh, sorry. So I am excited for my birthday that we managed to get last minute booking. What a last minute we did it yesterday. Oh, and I'm here with, of course, yours, my favorite room B. I'm excited. Here is Strasbourg. We are really late now. Hi, guys. I'm so happy we finally got a booking here at the Camazon House. It's one of the finest houses ever with the most beautiful. Look at the windows, just how amazing they are. It's one of the beautiful houses here in Strasbourg, and getting a reservation here is amazing people i think are starting to come in because they open at six for dinner and we're having my birthday dinner here yay me thank you rumbi being a starter grace is having a onion pie. onion pie and i'm having the pumpkin soup with chestnuts so this is us now at the restaurant bon appetit. Bon appetit. okay we're finally having our mains now Finally having fish. The whole time I've been here, I've been having beef, pork, or red meat. So having fish is actually a change, which is great. You have to get that. Um, for my starter, I had the onion pie, which was unbelievable. We had some bacon inside, which was really good. And it's got some haddock. If I turn it around, that's salmon. That's salmon. Yes, there's haddock inside the lentils. Um, so it's quite healthy for a change. Well, we've been away for me anyway on this trip. And it's really packed now, so that's all really good. Bon appétit, Wimby. Bon appétit. Oh. Is it coming? Hansi? I had to do translation. What, in French? Oh, they would say like, oh, what do you have for your dessert? Uh, cheesecake and sorbet. And there's a bit of fruit. A little bit of fruit and the sorbet. It's a raspberry sorbet. Is that a pineapple? Yeah, it is pineapple. And cheesecake. I'm not a big fan of cheesecake. Oh. <laughs> oh. Happy oh birthday, God. Grace. Thank you so much. That was the same in French for me. It was also someone else's birthday today. So that was so cool. So that, my dessert is melting, but it says happy birthday in French. Can you see it, Ruby? Yes, I can see it. Oh, thank you so much. December 19th is finally here. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, Grace. Happy birthday to you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It is for request, oh, Gracie. So cool. <laughs> Are you happy, Gracie? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Ruby. I'm 32. <laughs> Great, the people are amazing. Yep, this is everyone that's been here. Oh gosh, it's never ending. I don't think I can finish them all. What's this? Okay, it's so um, popular. Oh, anyway, happy birthday to me. It's been great. We've had an amazing time. Oh, I'm yeah, so that, full. That actor. That actor. Yeah, yeah, I, I know him. Oh, really? And the Pope. Okay, so if you're in Strasbourg, this is where you need to come and eat. Very famous because of the exterior of the building. It's known as the most beautiful building here in Strasbourg. It's called Maison Camazel. I'm not pronouncing it right. Right next to the cathedral. You have to book way in advance, otherwise you won't get any booking. It's fully packed, so busy here. <sighs> anyway, bonsoir. No. Okay, one last time. Goodbye, Strasbourg. This is where we're dining for Grace's birthday. That's okay, you can go. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. You. No, it's okay. Oh, you want to take a picture? No, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, so goodbye, Strasbourg. We need to go back home and pack to go to our next city. 
it's been nice and it's a beautiful way to close our last night because it's not cold and December the 19th happens to be a special day for a special somebody ah, let's go Rumbi till next time till next time off to Colma in the morning experience the magical city of Colma yes Strasbourg knows how to do Christmas certainly do Goodbye, Strasbourg. My sister's taking her time. I mean, if you don't catch. Oh, wow. Oh, minutes parity. Okay, there we are. We're heading off to Basel. Oh, no, no, Basel. Coma. Oh, I'm out of breath because we we've decided to take the train. We're about to take the coach because it's much better. Scenic view. And here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Found someone really nice to show us around his city. <laughs> yeah, so we are in Coma. Oh, okay. Oh, Ruby, that's where the gingerbread house is. So you can see it from here. Oh, because there's a market there, isn't it? Oh, yes, that's for, that's the bridge. Oh, cool. That's so good. It's not very clear here. Everything, exactly, make sure that everyone they, is fine. They, they killed him, so. <laughs> yeah, so that helps. Sorry. Oh, this is beautiful. That's the, the market. Oh, that's the market there, I was seeing. This is. Hey, Ruby. We found the little city of Venice. I'm so excited. You can see this is the city trademark of white. Absolutely magical. There's lots some works going on behind us. A lovely guy just over there oh my goodness showed us a little trick an easier way to get here so nice he went out of his way to bring us here and the city is empty today so I love it when it's empty and it's not raining it was raining a little bit before But it's beautiful for Poma. So come along with us and have a look. You can see you still have timber houses here in Coma because of the French and the German occupying this place at different times. Anyway, enjoy our videos. I love the white Christmas trees. And which one? Oh look at this one. Oh god, this is not even bright. And look at how beautiful. This place is as we approach. Oh, it's not so clear. Oh, this is not cool. All right, so we're just gonna head this way. So, Rumbi, we want to go to the next bridge instead of this one. Where is she? Oh, she's over there. Look at all this. Ta da! That is a pretty, pretty view. I'm gonna move to, we're gonna move to the next bridge. It's just not clear on my camera how beautiful this is. Unbelievably stunning. Wait, 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 Rumbi. Look at how and the colors on your scarf. It looks so beautiful. Rumbi. I'm ready to race for my picture. Okay, and oh, Coma has its own charm. This is Petite Venice, or Little Venice, they call it. <coughs> Excuse me, the sun is coming out now. We're heading off to the second bridge to have a better view of the rest of the houses because look at how dark it is it's not doing it any justice if i am on this side it's a little bit cloudy but there's a bit of sun <coughs> excuse me so but that doesn't bring out quite nicely this is nice <laughs> we're just in awe aren't we <coughs> excuse me sorry it's dark well sorry to ourselves that it's dark we want it slightly brighter and oh. okay 
much better on this side well a little bit I think if I move right to the corner slightly better <sighs> we're getting to it isn't this so magical it's magical where we came from and my sister's somewhere behind me oh there she is and then if I come on this side oh, look at how magical this place is it's so magical it's magical where we came from and my sister's somewhere behind me oh there she is and then if I come on this side oh, look at how magical this place is wait Rumbi wait wait this is the day when you want something to really come out exactly as it is in person but the camera just fails you just doesn't do what you want it to do and my oh it's finally showing how magical this place is because the sun is gone which we're happy about oh this is so good love Alza's region it's so great and this is just the beginning of it there is more to come, there is more to come, there is more, there is more, and there is more. That's crazy on the other side. <laughs> Absolutely magical. Beautiful, stunning. Okay, we're gonna head off to the next stop. And then come back after we've taken, because it's gonna start raining anytime soon. So it's better that we head off now and come back, come back, come back with my big head in the way here in the beautiful Petit Venice. I'm going to move out of the way because some people want to take pictures. Ruby, hey Ruby, <laughs> December 20th. How are you feeling today? I am feeling amazing. Do you want to move on this side because the sun is not on that side? Beautiful landscape. Look at this and the canal. We, we can't even do the canal cross because it's closed. They can't do it over the winter time. But anyway, we're happy because the sun is out a little bit and it's not raining that much. Oh my god, this is actually even a beautiful angle. Coma is amazing. We just met some lovely people from South Africa. And I also oh, Rumbi. <laughs> Sorry. What museum is this? Well, we're going to get our museum passes. Oh, there's a little market here, tiny little one, I think. Oh gosh, oh, every s what, what do they have? Okay, I'm not sure I want to get those. Thank you very much. Oh, they're from Ghana. They're Nigeria. We found this lovely stall here in Coma that sells African items from Benin. The lady is nice, she gave us some mulled wine. It's near the colorful houses and she's usually here all the time. And guess what they have? They have mawuyu, baobab fruits. What they've got, meringue? Meringue? Dried meringue. And look at the dolls. Meringue seeds. Black African dolls, which are so beautiful. Oh, look at that one right at the top there. Oh, that one is pretty. That is so nice. That's so beautiful. Oh, look at the African prints. Do you know what I'm going to get? I'm going to get the baobab. But I don't have milk to put them in. It's such a good drink. It's got ginger. Mm. 
Mm. It's so delicious. I thought it was going to be so, so good. Those heads are like the ones from Tanzania. Or Tanzania. If you're from Zimbabwe, you say Tanzania. <laughs> right. This is one of my favorite. Rumbi bought the baobab fruit. Mawuyu. Cost five euros. And then you got the dolls. One of my favorite things here. Just in Colma. If you're around in Colma, you can see. Nice. That lady was so lovely. She kept on giving us free food. We got the baobab fruit and some nuts. And we couldn't get the ginger drink because we're not going to be able to finish that. And then we can't carry on our um, hand luggage. So we're heading off into the old town. So, as you can see, it's almost like a gisheim. A gisheim. So you pronounce a gisheim. This is stunning. Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to look for a bin. So we're about to get into the Old Town section from the Le Petit Venice. Now how do I throw away this rubbish? Ruby, have you been reading the signs on the floor? Sorry. Sorry. People are here. Uh, oh, Malt wine is actually really nice. I might have some more. I think when we were in Vienna, we had.